City of Erie firefighters getting some first-hand training today simulating a rescue operation. Brian Wilk was there and explains how important for re it is for rescue crews to get this kind of experience. Brian? Hi, Sean. Crews were up at Don John Shipping Yard. Their training exercise being hoisted down a 30-foot shaft at hoisting up an injured victim. Erie firefighters doing confined space rescue training, hoisting crews down a shaft to rescue someone who either fell down or passed out in the shaft. They actually have to do this yearly as a refresher to be certified to go ahead and, and do confined space rescues. So it's, it's an OSHA regulation. He says a lot of things can happen in a confined space rescue, hazards in the atmosphere, explosives, oxygen deficiency. You have to monitor the space continuously, air monitoring, they got to have retrieval lines, fall protection, there's a lot that goes on, a lot of rigging and uh, OSHA standards. Erie firefighter Kyle Miller was one of the crews that was hoisted down. Basically we were monitoring the environment and we were going down in the event that somebody would fall or we would have to rescue them. He says it's not often they have to use this training, but it's still important to have. It's really important. I mean, you know, this is something thankfully that we don't have to do on a regular basis and uh, we don't want to get complacent, so we try to do this annually and stuff to remain fresh with it. Barbarini says the training with other Erie Fire Department crews will continue for the next few days. Sean? Right, thanks, Brian.